What are your other dream roles? Uh, um, it's funny, they've shifted. Uh, you know, I, I got to play Lois Lane in Superman uh, this past winter, and there's a bird who's playing as Superman, and we had so much fun. And uh, John Rando and I, um, for the first time, allowed Lois to be funny and sexy and smart. And you got to really see why Superman is in love with her, or Clark Kent is. And that was so much fun. I mean, that would be a dream for that to go to Broadway. But um, I don't know, Anna and the King and I, I would love to tackle because I think Anna has to be strong. And that's, I always bring that. But uh, you, you bring strength, but the other thing I love that you bring, and um, uh, that Chapin and I were talking about this with you, is you add, when you walk on stage, there's such a sense of. Don't expect to know where we're going. Yeah. And that is a great quality. It just instantly compels the audience to you. Keep them on their toes. Keep them on their toes, but makes them feel really alive. Yes. Really like we're all in this because here's this person who's, this performer who's saying to us, that, you know, I mean, you just, you, you just bring a perspective and a, um, a, a sense that is really compelling. It just draws people, and that's that's rare in a performer. Did you always like? Did you? Did you were like, oh my God, this kid's talented, or how was this? You know up? what? I uh, growing up, I, I used to beg my mom to let me audition for Star Search. Mm. You know, when I was like, <laughs> what? You know, in second grade, yeah. and she said, she would say, oh Jenny, uh, she was not a stage mom. She said, Jenny, oh, uh, you know, I want you to be normal and go to school. And, and honestly, honey, I don't know if you have that kind of voice, the kind of voice that would. Um, that it takes to really make it, and I thought, and that would, I thought, yes, I do, and it drove me even more. Mm. Um, and yes, I've always had a different voice. I don't have your classic belt or your classic soprano, and um, and I'm, you know, not that all-American look. There's something a little exotic, I guess. But I'm almost 100% Irish, so it's inter <laughs> it's it's interesting. But I, um, I've always loved living in my imagination, mm. and. I mean, I could be there for hours, and that's why the Muni is always has always been such a challenge for me because I love nuancing the hell out of characters, and you're not given that much time. No. And so I, so what's also cool is that even at closing, I'm still f mining. You know, I'm still like digging out these gems, um, and I don't know how to do it any other way. I don't know how to don't don't just change. be like this surfacey. Yeah. I have to bring. Yeah. But that's actually the quality I couldn't find a word for it for two, two minutes ago. That's it. There's always an inner investigation going on stage with you. Yeah. There's always an investigation. Because why else do it? Yeah. That's right? Yeah. I mean, that, that's how, uh, so I, and I, I know as a little girl going to the theater, I, I knew the difference. Mm -hmm. When someone was really bearing their soul and heart versus just going through the motions, I knew. You know? But um, no, this is this is a gift. This is a huge challenge. Let uh, me tell you, it's not a small part. It's not a small <laughs> part, and it's not a small show. It's a huge challenge. But I thank you so much for the opportunity because honestly, it's a, she's a tricky character, and um, I bow to the women who've done it before because it's a huge thing. But um, it's such a trick. She's a tricky um, role because she's more creature than human, but she's having this great human experience. You and know? there's also in, in, in this, there's what was brought in for this script, for the stage adaptation, was more material from the original books, which is a little bit different than the film, so there's a whole layer that people don't know of of Mary Poppins, at least only if they know the film, although if you look closely at the film, it's all there. Yeah. It's really all there, it's just there in a different way, so... And Mike, I have to commend you for taking such a leap of faith on this one. This is a huge show for the community <laughs> to put on in this amount of time, you know, and uh, and also... Gary Griffin, Gary Griffin. Gary Griffin, Gary Griffin, Gary Griffin. Gary Griffin. Gary Griffin. But also, um, you know, we're cutting things and yeah. we've been allowed because we've talked to the creatives yes. or you have, you've made it possible, yes. you've been the facilitator, <laughs> you've been Mary Poppins yeah. behind the scenes yeah. manipulating <laughs> to, do the, to do the version that yeah. we want to do. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you.